hardly a week after the once a flamboyant Zimbabwean gold dealer, Torai Pult supporter, died and was buried in Tsving. Some strange happenings continued to take place at his house in Nyamoru, according to neighbors. Supporter is believed to have returned to bathe at his house at number 7076 hardly a day after he was laid to rest at Tsving Cemetery. Sources who confided to the weekend on Tuesday said the immaculately dressed supporter, who is supposed to be six feet under, came and took a bath, much to the shock of neighbors and tenants. It's too sensitive. Please don't publish my name. A lot is happening there. He was found bathing at the house a few hours after his death. We are neighbors and we are living in fear. Some tenants vacated the house as soon as they heard some strange sounds in the bathroom, he said. Another neighbor who was interviewed separately said the area was no longer a safe place to move around, especially during the night. We sometimes hear some stones being thrown at nearby houses. Vanuva Munivana Bata Bata. We are no longer safe and we live in fear, she said. Some mythical creatures and artifacts believed to be wealth-enhancing tools were found at the house the day Torai Paul's supporter died. He died last Saturday morning at Old Muta Mission Hospital where he was admitted for close to eight months. Supporter, according to his friends, fell sick in March with just a swollen hand which he assumed to have been caused by boils, but by the time of his admittance into hospital, he had reportedly gone insane. Neighbors said tenants at supporters' house refused to sleep in the house the evening after the incident. Witnesses said four self-styled prophets from the Joe and Masao Yizvaratidzo were no match for the goblins until late in the evening when another self-styled prophet, Madzaiba Bakarito, came to the rescue. Four prophets, a woman and three men were hired for the mission. Supporters' wife removed a clay pot, Zvuma, traditional beads, Retso, red, white and black cloth. The Katwa, Dagger, Nigano, a small axe. These were removed with no problems. However, when one of the male prophets tried to remove a cow horn like object with hairy human skin on it and fresh blood pouring out, that is when the drama began. The horn was kept inside the mattress in its supporter's bedroom. The prophet was mysteriously hit and fell to the ground.